Bella Thorne's recent rebellious attitude is finally making more sense to me thanks to her new, unbelievably candid interview in Harper's Bazaar. From contemplating suicide, to being a Disney puppet, to having a crush on K-Stu, Bella really goes there. In the magazine, Bella's spread is elaborate as she portrays the historic sex icon Marilyn Monroe. Bella is blonde, naked, and wrapped in sheets, but the interview is where her vulnerability really shows. Let's start with her past. It all started with modeling when she was six years old. Her mom was her momager and wanted her to be a singer, but Bella took off as an actress on the series Shake It Up. As we've all heard, Disney often has strict rules for their child stars. Bella was told to speak in a higher voice during interviews because her deep voice wouldn't appeal to young audiences. In another instance, Disney freaked out when Bella was photographed wearing a bathing suit. After that, her mom only wanted Bella to conform to Disney rather than be herself. Bella explains, I was just a puppet. I wasn't allowed to make my own decisions or think for myself in any way. She only figured out who she really was after her series Shake It Up ended. She started dyeing her hair different colors and left her momager. Now, Bella is being herself, but in the public eye, which has its drawbacks. Bella has been scrutinized for her different looks, her relationships, especially the drama surrounding her and Charlie Puth, and her lifestyle. So now, she's just putting it all out there. She says, the world needs more honesty. I've lied my whole life about who I am and who I'm trying to be, so now I like to keep it real. She continues, I've had really dark thoughts. When I was younger, I thought about killing myself. It's very normal in a way that if you're upset with who you are and how your life is going, you could think these things. I want people to know that it's okay to talk about it. Mental health has been a subject Bella discusses with fans on social media. Something else she's been open about is her sexuality. Openly bisexual, sometimes she gets confused about playing the field. She says, I can't tell if a girl is hitting on me or just wants to be friends. And I don't want to flirt with a girl if she thinks I'm just trying to be her friend. What if I kiss a girl and she's like, oh, I'm just your friend, dude. I can't believe you just crossed that boundary. I'm confused on what they want from me. But at the end of the day, Bella prefers to be a one woman or one man girl. This is the longest I've been super single. There are so many unwritten rules about dating, which I don't like. I'd rather be super faithful and give my all to one person person. I don't like having my phone blown up by a bunch of different guys where I don't really know where I stand with any of them. It sucks. And as for who she has her eye on, in particular, it's a girl. I've done other stuff with girls, but I want to actually date a girl. Kristen Stewart is so hot. She seems like the raddest chick I'd be so down. So what do you guys think? Should K-Stu become K-Thorn? Let me know in the comments below. I'm Stephanie Gray, and for more videos, click the boxes and make sure to subscribe to Holly Scoops.